G'day Space Cadets. It's Monday and aren't you just pumped to start another working week? No? Don't worry. We know. We're all meant to love what we do, chase our dreams, etc, etc. We're here to say, don't beat yourself up if you're not skipping into the office or bursting to get to your work from home setup. There's a belief that happy employees are the best employees. Well, myth busted. In some places, this can be true, but it's not a given. Some studies found that happy employees can have a negative effect on productivity. An article in the Harvard Business Review laid out the evidence, and it's a mixed bag. Some research shows that happy employees are less likely to leave a company. But, and this is a big but, different data showed that happy employees can impact profit. It turns out, a pursuit of happiness can be exhausting and distracting. Researchers asked a group of people to watch a film that would usually make them happy. But, before watching the film, half of the group were asked to read out a statement about the importance of happiness in their lives. That group were less happy after watching the film. Why? They overthought it. So let's bring it back to your workplace. Are you stuck on the idea of being happier? Do you compare yourself to other people on Instagram? They seem so happy in their jobs. The result is, you're going to be distracted and the opposite of present. What a relief it would be if we all realised. Sometimes it's a good job. Sometimes it's shitty. And sometimes it's just okay. We don't have to love our boss and count our blessings every single day we log in or get into the office. This is our plea to you. Let's end our obsession with loving what we do all of the time. If you do, that's great, and we are so happy for you. If you don't, you don't need to feel like you're failing. While all those people are caught up on being happy, you might just be meh but nailing your weekly targets. And that's a reason to be grateful. Space out.